Hello, it's me again. Today I want to talk about yet another case of disk rot, of DVD rot. So I purchased this Korean drama, um, Time Between Dog and Wolf, on DVD. So this is the design of the package. It's a rather decent and very collectible package design. There you go. That's the design of the spine. And there's the design of the back. All in all, I really, really like the package design of this particular drama. So when this one arrived to my home, I felt really, really happy because, well, this is um, a wonderful, wonderful packaging. But when I opened the package, I found a terrible, terrible issue with the disc that is disc rot. So... It's a uh, brilliant packaging, everything's wonderful, but the disc they suffer from disc rot, so um, that is not good. So, we're going to take a look at the disc. So, open this one, and that is the proof. I bought it brand new and sealed. That's the package, the, um, the plastic, that's the seal, and then this is some kind of a promotional stuff to redeem the poster because they advertised this one with a poster. I guess we need to redeem that one through, you know, this one and send it to the mail. And the actual DVD is inside this box, basically a regular box, but this one is bulkier because it consists of eight um, DVD nine. So um, we're going to take a look at the um, the discs. The design of the box is exactly the same as the design of the um, outer box. There you go, that's the spine, and that is the um, the back. And it's such a shame because I, apart from the fact that the packaging is amazing, I also, I really want to watch this particular Korean drama because um, I noticed some of the reviews were very positive and I wanted to watch this one, but I can't watch it now, so. Well, we're going to see the discs inside. There you go. There are eight discs. And to my surprise, every single one of them, they suffer from disc rot. And so now unplayable. And the rot, the, um, the issue is just to... Um, it's just too serious, you know. The damage is too serious. It's um, The rot is just too overwhelming so there's no way to play these um, discs this is disc 8 so that's disc 7 disc um, 6 5 um, 4 3 2 and 1 so um, it's it's such a shame because apart from um, you know, apart from the fact that, you know, one, I want to watch this Korean drama is that um, they use DVD-9, so double-layered disc, and one disc only holds two episodes, meaning that they really, really do not sacrifice the um, image quality for space. You know, some some distributors, they, they put three or four episodes in single disc and some of them they're not even double layer but this one is dvd9 double layer and then only two episodes each disc and that's going to preserve the image quality so um if this works the image quality should be um amazing and the bitrate and all should be great because there's no reduction in image quality so let's try to see the reflective layer of the first disc and there you go that's the state of the disc right now there's no way that this is going to play and i tested it already on my player none of them play and all of them they have the exact same you know similar pattern similar disc raw there you go this is very very um problematic and you can really really see the damage there there is no way that we're going to play this one. That looks awful. And same thing for disc 2 and 3 and 4. Disc 2, the same thing. The same rot. 
that is not good. And then disk three, I don't, I don't even bother to take it out because um, the situation is exactly the same. And then disk um, four, you can see disk four, exactly the same. So all of them, they suffer from the same problem. And they really got such an amazing artwork for the disc. You know, they're different, you know, from one another. A lot of distributors, they just use the exact, the exact same artwork for the disc. But this one, they use different artwork for all of the eight discs. So if this works, this is basically an amazing package. It's a very, very good package. But um, sadly... Uh, the quality that they use to make this one is not as good. So this is a um, you know a problem for movie collectors, and this is a minus point for physical media collectors that you know people who really really do not like physical media and people who really really um, advocate for um, cyber and streaming platforms are going to say that you know DVD they um, they suffer from this all the time so we can't rely on those things on the discs um, this is a very very this is, this is giving a bad name to physical media you know because in reality physical media should last even longer than this one I mentioned that in my video of Spirit Style of the Cimarron if they use the best Possible material, the, the the quality of the um of the disc should be um great, should be amazing, even better than this one. And to prove that, I already um you know make the um the um the video about spirit cell of the Cimarron, but, but then I think I need to point it out even more is that um some of the discs that I have um I'm, I'm going to take the oldest disc in my collection is that this CD of um, Alan Tam. The CD was manufactured in 1994. This DVD is probably manufactured in um, I don't know. It's it's it should be manuf it, 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 it probably manufactured in um, 2010. Perhaps there's no way of telling because this one is wrong. It's not 2020. It's way way before that. Uh, this is probably a typo here. It's not twenty twenty, probably twenty ten or pro or eleven. I I can't really tell because I can't even play this one, so I can't I can tell when this was manufactured exactly. So this CD is um, you know, is a testament of the endurance of physical media that's going to be you know, that's going to live very very long time this cd was manufactured as i said before in 1994 so before i was born and to this day this still plays just fine there you go and we're going to see the reflective layer of this cd the cd is nearly 30 years old there you go that's the reflective layer there's no sign of degradation and it still plays perfectly to this day. So the Music City of Alan Tam, this is the oldest um, pressed disc that I have in my collection, the oldest manufactured, I mean uh, not a CDR or DVDR, this is um, manufactured by this, you know, um, music distributor and all. I also decided to take the oldest video CD that I have in my collection. The oldest video CD is The Last of the Mohicans. Video CD was first introduced to the market back in 1993, but I do not have any video CD as old as that. So this one is manufactured in 1997. It's The Last of the Mohicans. This is video CD 1.1. And we can see over there, um, first of all, package design 1997, and then it was registered to the government. This is the censorship or, you know, well, the registration number um, that was registered to the Indonesian government. This was um, registered in um, 2nd of July 1997. So this one is also nearly. 
30 years old but the the disc is still in a very very good condition there is no sign of disc rot whatsoever there you go the reflective flare is still perfect and i just played this one last week there's no problem with the disc and my oldest dvd is from i think it was from 1999 is the matrix dvd and it also still plays just fine today so um I don't know, it's a, it's such a shame that such a brilliant, um, you know, release is plagued by disc rot. And it's not that, it's not that, um, you know, I actually, I'm, you know, the, 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 the sellers, um, you know, we, how to say this one? Actually, I contacted the, I called the seller and then told the seller that this one is broken. And the seller said that, oh, I can have a refund and we are going to um, arrange that. But it's not about that. It's not really what I want. I don't really want a refund for this one. What I really want is this particular package. But I really have no choice because, you know, this package is damaged. There's nothing I can really do to... Um, to fix the problem so it's such a shame really really such a shame so i just want to share about that to you guys today about yet another problem you know of disc rot and this one is manufactured in hong kong so i don't know i don't know is there any correlation about the country of origin and those things but well, this is a big, big uh, letdown for me today. I really anticipated this package and I really, really wanted to watch this uh, series. And I, as I said before, I really, really adore the package design. It's just a brilliant packaging. I can see that they really put effort in putting together this package, but um, the disc is uh, plagued by disc rot and I can't do anything. I'm going to put this back in the box and then I'm going to return this back to the seller to get the refund but you know I, I hope that this is not going to be um, you know the worst possible I mean it's, I, I don't I, I really wish that this is not going to discourage people from collecting um, disc I just want people to take note and then to pick the disc very very carefully to take notes about the distributor and then to learn the pattern which distributor makes better disc and those things and and also i'm starting to consider about collecting more vhs tapes because vhs tapes i think they're going to be they're going to last even longer i think because i don't know there's it's a, the disc is supposed to live longer than VHS tapes and video CDs and CDs prove that I have less damaged video CDs and CDs compared to DVDs and Blu-ray. So, um, talking as a collector, I really, really, um, um, I prefer to have, you know, lower resolution, but but the stuff going to live longer rather than having a higher pristine the best resolution but it's going to fade away in uh you know less than 10 years so um i better um have vhs and video cd even though they got lower resolution but it's i know i'm going to be um, at peace knowing that my collection will live longer much much longer for years and years to come rather than having the best possible image quality and best possible audio quality but they're not going to live as long because we're, we're collecting I'm, I'm i'm collecting the the content the movies the the music i want them to live in my possession forever and this is not a good sign of it so Talking about the image quality, they should be the best. Talking about the audio quality, they should be the best. But the material for the disc is just awful. So it's a huge letdown. So that is all that I want to share with you at this very moment. If you're still here, I say sincerely thank you. Take care and goodbye.